hello students as you are observing on screen today we are going to discuss about decimals what are decimals any fraction having numerator 10 or multiple of 10 such type of fraction is known as your decimal for example it's a 3 upon 10 clear or we can say 49 upon 1000 all these having denominators multiple of 10 so these are known as your decimal how we write this in a form decimal c first we write the digits given in numerator and denominator we have multiples of 10 so in this case 10 is there means after one decimal in uh, for one we write decimal and zero means number of digit after decimal so here one zero to one digit so we can write down 0 0.3 or in this case we can write down 49 now one for decimal now one two three digit so we have to add one zero so three 0 0.049 that you already discussed you already we already discussed in class 6 how to convert decimal numbers into mixed number for example this one suppose it's given to you 8.93 so we can write down 893 for this decimal 1 after 1, 1, 2, 2, 0. Likewise, no? hope you can easily understand or you can write down 8 whole 93 by 100. Hope this one is clear to you. Move to the next part. Next question says that write the fraction with denominator 10 and then express as decimal. For example, I am picking 3 upon 5. So we can multiply 3 into 2 divided by 5 into 2. So it's a 6 upon 10. So we can write down 0. Point 1 then 6 because 1 0 is then 0 0.6 now operations how we add for addition always rem remember I am using very simplest question one is add 0 0.008 9 use plus 0 0.0065 0 0.0065 plus next one is 0 0.07 if you have any confusion you can message me or comment in a comment part First, we have to convert them into like decimal. Like decimal means after decimal, we have same number, equal number of digit. So see, after decimal, four digit, after decimal, four digit, after decimal, two digit. So we have to convert that into four digit. How we convert? It's very easy. Plus we add two more zero to make same number of digit after decimal. Now we can add them nine five fourteen one carry eight one nine nine six fifteen 
वन कैरी आई थिंक इज देयर सेवन वन एट जीरो जीरो सो जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एट फाइव फोर लाइक वाइज यू टू कन्वर्ट यू टू एड रिमेंबर इफ डेसीमल्स आर नॉट विथ सेम डिजिट आफ्टर डेसीमल नंबर वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट देम बाय एडिंग टू जीरो एट द एंड लाइक वी हैव टू कन्वर्ट एट दिस प्लेस न होप दिस वन इज क्लियर मूव टू द नेक्स्ट पार्ट नाउ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज सब्ट्रैक्ट एट पॉइंट थ्री फाइव फ्रॉम नाइन पॉइंट टू हाउ वी सब्ट्रैक्ट इट्स वेरी इजी फर्स्ट वी राइट देन चेक विदर दे आर सेम लाइक डेसीमल मीन्स आफ्टर डेसीमल वी दे आर सेम डिजिट और नॉट हियर दे वन हियर टू सो वी हेव टू कन्वर्ट देम इन टू लाइक डेसीमल्स नाइन पॉइंट टू जीरो माइनस एट पॉइंट थ्री फाइव Now we subtract ten minus five five, eleven eleven minus three nine, eight minus eight zero zero point nine five. Likewise, you have to subtract other one. Now see, in this case, we have a number twenty nine point four nine eight one into ten thousand. Remember, if we are going to multiply a decimal number with multiple of ten or multiple of ten or multiple of ten, then this decimal shift to the right hand side, depending upon the number of zeros. See here, one, two, three, four zeros are there. So this decimal shift to four times that side. So you can write down two nine four nine eight one. No, see one nine two three four one two three four. This is the answer. But if there are not multiple of ten, then how we multiply? See this question. Very smallest question. But we have to multiply zero point zero two and zero point zero four. Zero point zero two into zero point zero four. How we multiply? First, we check the number of digit. It's a four to the eight. Now, how many digits after decimal? Two here, two here means four digits. So zero point one two three and this one four. Likewise, na. Or if it says that. Uh, For example, one point three into two point one. Then first multiply. Uh, need not to first care about decimal. First simply multiply. Thirteen one ja thirteen. Thirteen two ja twenty six. Twenty six plus one twenty seven. How many digits decimals are there? One plus one two two point seven three. Likewise, you have to multiply. Hope this one is clear to you. Try to complete this one. Come to the division part. Eight point divide eight point nine by ten. Remember, in this type of condition. Just opposite to multiplication, we shift decimal to the left hand side. So it's a zero point eight nine. Why? Because th there is one zero. So this decimal shift to one place. Suppose it is given four nine eight one forty nine point eight one divided by one thousand. So in this case. Decimal shift to three digits. One, two, three. Zero point four nine eight one. Clear. Hope this one is clear to you. Now, if not ten or multiple of ten is given, then how you divide? 
6.25 divided by 0 0.5 how we simplify this one easy by 0 0.5 now numerator and denominator they are not in like decimal so first we make them like decimals 6.25 divided by 0 0.50 now after decimal two digit after decimal two digit we can easily remove the digits it's a 625 by 50 now we can easily solve 25 twos are 25 twos are 50 25 fives are it's a 25 upon 2 and if question asked to you convert into decimal so you have to convert into decimal by it's a 12.5 so likewise you have to divide that's all for this try to complete by yourself exercise 2c because all these things we already discussed in class 6 and 5 if you have faced any problem then you message me then i will sort out your mistakes so that's all for today. Thank you.